right. You too. All right, so you might know what this bike is. You might not. Um, it's a 2002 Honda VFR 800. I always like these bikes, man. I always love these bikes. And now I got one. Um, 16,000, almost 17,000 miles on it. Uh, you know it's going to be a lot of mods coming. And it's going to be fun, man. Really fun. So I already test rode it. This is the actual ride. Okay. And trying to get my way out of this neighborhood. Okay. So, yeah, if I'm stuttering a little bit because kind of don't know where I'm going. So I'm trying to just, okay, now I know where I'm going. But yeah, I rode it for the first time and it was lovely. Let me make sure my, my, uh, phone is zipped up. Everything is zipped up, nothing falls out. Uh -oh. I'm the guy to my wife out too, so. But yeah, I've been looking into this bike. Um, I like this year, model year. So, I found one. And yeah, so, um, <laughs> this kind of sudden, you know, it wasn't like something that was just, I planned on doing. So, here we are. Um, there's a lot of mods I looked into doing with this bike. So, um, you know, <laughs> right now I'm just kind of excited, so don't mind me. I think this is the way, yep. So I'm about to take it out on a little main road here on the way home where I can go a little faster. But man, this it feels so so good. And I didn't get to sell the um the um the Venom yet, so I'm gonna have five bikes. So <laughs> hopefully I get to sell that sometime this week where it frees me up some room. But um Yeah, I'm excited that I got this bike. feels good yeah they, when they said the thing that just leans over it does lean over feels good though yeah so um, I found this on Facebook marketplace um, I actually got it for 2,500 17,000 miles on it new tires he says it probably needs a new battery soon So if you didn't know, it's a sport touring bike. So, <laughs> if you guys were guessing what I was getting, you know, not a surprise. <laughs> so yeah, a lot of things I'm gonna do to it, but um, 
Yeah. Didn't, didn't know I was going to get it, but kind of did know I was going to get it, you know? So, yeah, rides definitely feels good. Um, no gear indicator on it. I mean, it is a 2002, and I'm probably going to put one on here just because... Um, yeah, feels really good. And I got it in my favorite color, so that's another good thing. I gotta put a phone mount on it. So, as far as I know, it's a 781cc. And my brother really thought I was gonna get a cruiser for my next bike. He really thought I was, but nah. You know, for the price, um, it's a, um, it was a good deal. It was a really good deal. So, um, yeah, it's a hot day today. It's a couple mods I'm going to do to it, like I said. So, get ready for those. Um, seat height, it's around the same as my... It's probably a little bit taller uh, than my CBR. But, you know, not bad. Not bad at all. These bikes are known to be reliable. Um, this model year, I looked into it before I got it. I didn't just get it. And it already came with the smoke windscreen. So that's good. So yeah, my wife told me, she's like, ride next to me. I'll get some video of you. I'm like, cool. So maybe I might put in this video, maybe not. But, um, yeah. So, um, I'll do a comprehensive review on how the deal went. Um, it went pretty quickly. That didn't take me that long to realize I wanted the bike. So he told me the things that he done to it, that he changed the thermostat uh, for the fans to kick in. They kick in a lot sooner, so, you know. So, yeah, I always wanted a, a bigger sport touring bike, but I didn't want the CBR 650. Um, 650R, and I didn't want a Kawasaki, and I really don't like the new, how the new ones look, and I wasn't trying to spend that type of money anyway. I, I knew I wanted a used bike, something I was going to fix up and do myself. But, um, yeah, it's very comfortable. I just gotta ride it some more to give you guys a view, but I gotta get it registered and stuff, so it's not gonna be really ridden that much, you know, as of yet. And plus, there's some things I wanna do to it. To make it ready, you know, for the road. But yeah, I'm gonna clean all this up a little bit, probably maybe even paint it. Um, the handlebars, they're, they're good. Uh, I'm gonna get a ram mount for it. You gotta do that. So yeah, it really feels good. And this this, this one this actually has VTEC. So <laughs> oh man, it won't be a joke when I put a sticker on it, right? Oh yeah, it feels good in the turn. Feels solid. All right. Considering it's 100 pounds more than my um, my uh, CBR 500R. Yeah, it feels good in the lean. So yeah, all you guys who ride, you guys know this bike.
Yeah, first thing I want to do is get a tail tidy for it. Plugs in so so like I can really hear the wind noise so yeah like I said in my last video uh, well not the last video the video before the last video sport touring is definitely my style So yeah, it looks like there's some rust around some things. I really want to clean it up. That's what I'm going to do. Clean. I'll probably take a lot of things apart. Clean it up. Do an oil change. <sighs> a lot of stuff to do. So we're going to get that done. Throughout the weeks to come. Check all the oils. Um, check the brakes. Just do a whole comprehensive check of, over the whole bike. Definitely got to get used to the friction point. This is different from all my other bikes. So yeah, man. It's like you never know what you're gonna get when you <laughs> when I'm when I when you're dealing with me, man. You never know. Yeah, I'm not gonna be doing that that much. <laughs> no, sir. Uh, this seat is comfortable though. I will say that it's a comfortable seat. Yeah, it's a little bumpy here, but it's taking the bumps pretty smoothly. Might have to He's like, everything is running good with it. The only thing I might need is a battery. So I'm not gonna register it until I sell one of my other bikes because I wanna use a, a, the plate that I have. I don't wanna buy another whole nother plate for what? So there's no reason to, so. Wait till I sell a bike, sign a title over. Oh, I might be able to do it before. So yeah, I looked. I already looked up a couple of because I already knew when I, I'm like, if it looks good and it doesn't look bad at all cosmetically, paint look, might, might need a wash, but in the cleanup, but other than that, it's pretty solid. Yeah, temperature seems to be around the normal operating temperature. But yeah, other than it just needs to be cleaned up cosmetically, it feels great. Can't wait to get it on the highway and really open it up, see what it does. But I'm going to check the oil. Yeah. And it's not too, uh, I guess it reminds me of my... Uh, my 500R a little bit, the seating. Although, is it a little more forward? I don't know, might be, might be. But like I said, it feels good. Um, I really wanna probably take all this stuff off and um, clean it up. 
I make it look really good. So for now, yeah, I got more bikes and I can, but I prepared just in case that somebody didn't come to put space, to make space. So that's what I'm gonna do. I mean, that's what I did. So is he gonna be parked easily? So, all right, guys, this is the first ride home. And glad you came with me. Appreciate you. I'll be back with another one. Peace.